going everyone welcome back to another shaving with surge i want to thank you guys for joining me on another video and for this video as promised from my last video is the unboxing i got two unboxings right here so you know me man cannot hide that excitement um so let's get right into it bro all right first one up is going to be from Sawdust Creations. And <sighs> super stoked, man. They mailman came like half an hour after I got home. So it comes, yeah, you know, wrap like this. Nice foam packaging. And voila. Voila. Ta-da. Alright, let me cool. Let's see. This is, let's see what this is first. This is Shrike Gold Shave Nostalgia. So a nice, ah, big, hefty sample. That's a big container. So, wow, thank you, Bobby. Thank you very much. Ah, smells nice. Nice, a nice medium mm -hmm. scent. I give us about a five and a half. Really good. And here we go, here we go. Check that out, Salt Dust Creations. This is a mixed resin and wood bowl. And all right, I'm loving this. I'm loving, I'm loving the size. I like how this bottom ring right here fits perfectly into the grip of my hand. Those colors, those colors, those blues, those greens, those purples, and it is just, absolutely beautiful i like the groove indentions on the inside they're not too deep so soap isn't going to get stuck in that and hard to break down i'm really liking this this is really cool the f and there's this coin man i'm blown away that people just create these things man that is awesome all hand turned and poured absolutely look at that look at those colors dude look at those colors look at those colors all right am i happy with this fuck yes perfect let me put this bad boy to the side let's keep going into the box of goodies and i got more foam airbags oh, oh, oh. i do see what's in here tony Catcher's Ciroli, Ciroli Seasoning. Seasoning. Uh, for food? Yeah, obviously for food, but it's, I'll try to see what kind of food. Um, soup, stews, salads, barbecue. Cool. Thank you. Gonna try it out. Do you like me some Southern food? And I believe uh, Saldus Creations Bobby is from Louisiana, so can't get much more South than that, right? Yeah, and here's his business cards in the back. So definitely check out Saldus Creations. He creates awesome shade bowls and brushes. And pull the trigger on a brush, you know, because because I need it, because I need it. And this is to be my first ever matching bowl and brush. And here it is. Look at that. Oh, nice. Um, fits in the hand perfectly, you know, it's a nice medium size handle, not oversized or anything like that. There's his logo. I went with the, I believe it's a Lumo synthetic uh, knot. I'm really digging synthetic knots for bowl shaves. So look at that. Again, one more time. Let's put the test. Does it fit in the holder? All I care, and it does. All I care about if it fits, whoops, if it fits in these holders, and it does. So that is perfect. This one needs more adhesive, that one's coming off. All right, so here we go. Boom, look at that, look at that. How gorgeous is that? How gorgeous is that? Again, just taking shaving to an art. That's what I love about this stuff. All this hardware is the art behind it. That's what keeps me buying new things. And definitely like the size of this one. 
Very happy, very happy. Do I have room for this stuff anymore? I don't know, I'm gonna figure it out. That's unboxing numero uno, number one. Just place this down to the side right now. Put that right there. Now, unboxing number two. Number two. All right. Here we go. I opened it upside down. Put that right there. All right. <laughs> All right. We're going to first, you know what? Let's go with the bowl. Let's go with the bowl. And this, I've been posting pictures of it. So excited for this one. So excited for this one. I know nobody has seen. I have not seen anything like this in the chasing. This is just bringing my personality, my personal likes into the chasing. And a big thank you to Jose um, over at Dark Sanctum because I kept asking him about it. I wanted it. And uh, man, thank you for doing it for me, man. This was a lot of work. It took 21 hours to print. And look at that. Look at that. Look at that. It is a skull bowl. And look at that. Look at, oh man. Oof, oof. Let's just see. Look at that. Lather in the skulls of your enemies. Just like in the old days when we used to drink from the skulls of their enemies. Oh man. I am absolutely happy with this. So 21 hours to print this. And uh, he wasn't sure if he was gonna be open to making any more of these, but he said he is. So private message him. He's gonna be linked down below. Solid Creations is gonna be linked down below. Check them out. And if you if you're interested in any in any of those, um, the the Solid Creation one was a custom pour. I told him what colors I wanted. And boom, that's what he gave me. This was a custom make. So just message them and see if they're both willing to make them for you. And uh, Jose say, I saw the shaving with Surge Skull Bowl. I want one. Make me one. And he told me he's, he's ordering uh, Glow in the Dark. Um, I, I don't know what you want to call it, the 3D print. And how cool would that be to have a Glow in the Dark shaving Skull Bowl? I might have to order another one. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Ah! Oh, man. Man, this is awesome. It is so cool, dude. Look at that. <laughs> I cannot get over this. Look at that. Oh, man. Dude, I make you guys proud. <laughs> oh, man. That shaving was surge in the skull bowl. Just, I cannot hide my joy and my excite excitement for this stuff. Man. All right. Let me... I could go on and on about how cool this is. <laughs> I'm going to put this off to the side so I can get to the other unboxings. All right. I'm debating whether I'm going to open up one of these. The other one I might save, <laughs> save for a group. <laughs> All right. And this is my brush. Check it out. It comes in this nice tube. He put the sticker in. Um, originally, he was gonna put it on the outside. I told him to leave it where I can use it. I wanna add it to my sticker collection. This is a larger sticker. Let's see if it goes right there. And not, I'll figure out a place to put it. Maybe just boom, on the door. I don't know, we'll see. Nice packaging. They now come with, um, I ordered this brush. It took a long time to get this brush. Like a month and a half, I've been waiting for it. And I, it was fine, I told him. He told me he was gonna be, originally he was doing um, beer coin, uh, brushes and um, I was almost gonna get one in, in remember you know in remembrance from you know when I used to drink some of my favorite beers but he told me he was making um, his own personal coin company coin and I was like dude I want that I want to be one of the first ones to have it I thought I was gonna be the first one to have it but Al Chigon is lives in San Diego right by him so of course he's gonna get it first right shout out to Al Chigon link down below check out his YouTube <laughs> so that's cool he threw in this magnet 
with his new company coin or company bottle, beer bottle cap, whatever you want to call it. And uh, so that's super cool. You could stick it on a magnet. I don't know if I have anything metallic in here. Nothing metallic in here that this would stick on. No. Okay. So that's really cool. Uh, so that's why I waited so long for the brush. So I'm not upset about it or anything like that. Not at all, because I told him I would wait. And he told me he was already waiting like two weeks for the bottle caps when I originally ordered. And uh, yeah, I, you know, I wasn't in a rush. I have a bunch of things. It wasn't like I needed it. I told him I would wait until he got it. And I'm glad I did. I'm glad I did. I, I almost was getting that itch where I wasn't gonna gonna wait. Um, and I was almost getting ready to say, just you know, give, give me a, you, uh, you have a dead guy, give me a dead guy bottle cap or something, you know, or uh, wa um, watermelon Dorado or something, you know, from Ballast Point. I know he has a bunch of stone. Stones were cool. Oh, um, what was it, Arrogant Bastard? Arrogant Bastard, that would have been cool. Um, and with every brush you buy, you get this cool 3D printed stand. So there's the brush. Look at that. So this is the Ronin X2, half red, half black. I will like the weight to this. It's got nice weight, nice size. Red tip synthetic. I tell you, I've been really digging synthetic lately. And there it is. There's his coin. And that's really cool. It's actually, I don't know if you can tell on, on camera, but it's actually resin set in. So I, I thought it was just going to be a bottle cap in there. I was kind of worried about like, would it get scratched up? Uh, but no, this is completely resin sealed. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, couldn't help, couldn't hold that one. I was trying. All right. Um, so that's resin sealed in. That is really cool. Look at that. And look at the brush and the handle. That Ronin X2. Oh, that is super cool. That is super cool. Look at that. Check, definitely check out Dark Sanctum. Dark Sanctum. Look at this. Whew. Boom. So there you go. Wow, there's a lot of, ooh, let's get that shaving. Oh. All right. <laughs> man all right and then i do have a special brush that was sent to me um i'm loader <laughs> i'm loader and i can't wait to use it this one i'm gonna do an unboxing for a special group of people so you guys when you guys see that one you guys will see that one this was a long unboxing but there's a lot of stuff here a lot of excitement Oh man, again, one more time. Let's show these bad boys off. Boom, boom. Yeah. <laughs> There's the coins, boom, boom. I feel like it's turning bad and white sometimes. Uh, all right, put that there, put that there. And that's all I got, guys. Tomorrow's a shave. What am I gonna use? I'm gonna use that skull tomorrow. Can't wait to use that one. I'll see you guys.